These treats are often found Music is this this fucking intense. How do I start the stream like in a way that feels like fluid? Hi. Howdy. Be equally as intense. 
I wish I could like zoom in on the camera just like slowly. Just like the music stops and it just like slowly zooms. Just... But alas, do something intense to no, 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 no. You guys are all giving me like actually good answers. That's not what I was. That's not what I was. I was fishing for. Not even. Not even a little bit. Let's see. Let's move this around. Hey, look! I got a new titty mouse pad. It's it's fucking. It's a two. But you wouldn't know her. Jumping jacks? I can do some jumping jacks. How are you guys doing? Oh no, she's what? Booba. I I fucking love Titty Mouse pads so fucking much. They just They just they just really they they bring me they bring me so much joy and also wrist support. I've been I've been rocking this one for a while, but as you can see uh, red sus among us titties are getting a little bit, uh, getting a little grimy. So I think it's time to, it's time to, um, retire, retire the among us. I'll put him right there so that he can be in the background. But yeah. Boobs are nice. They are nice. I, I, I just feel like everyone, everyone can, everyone can agree. Boobs are cool. I think very strange thing for everybody to just like inherently think are cool these just like you know fucking flesh pillows eject the among us yeah his suspicious titties have done you a service i think so a, 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 a long-standing service for sure but yeah oh yeah music yeah, yeah. yuna is like back here you can kind of see her little fluff right here She's just chilling, trying to figure out what the fuck I'm doing right now. Um, trying to, I'm trying to give her a little bit, you know, a little bit of autonomy over her own, you know, freedom and ability to walk around and stuff. Because for pretty much the entire first year of her life, which hasn't even been up yet, um, she just lives on in my lap or like on my desk. Like she would just be like right here. Um, yeah, and I think, you know, she's a, she's, she's becoming an adult. Poop in shoes. Yeah, well, that too. She did, she does love to poop in shoes. Well, I don't think she's actually ever pooped in a shoe, but she does like to shit. I, I, I can only imagine that's so because she does it so often. She's becoming less of a floor shitter. Eh, not really. I mean, some, it's just like, yeah, well, okay, yeah, I guess. Sometimes she shits where she's supposed to. She and I have that in common. That's fucking hot. All right. Let's, let's, let's turn down this, this really try hard Pokemon and uh, music and, and really, you know, really bring it back to when it was good, you know? You know what I'm saying? Today I've been like feeling like so fucking weird. Hey, what's up, Sab? Wow. Wow. I've been feeling like just exhausted. I don't know why. I just like woke up today and I just like, I don't know. I was about to say it's just one of those days where you just don't want to wake up. Everybody sucks. Splits? I, I got him. I got him. Don't worry. I'm not going to forget. I'm not going to forget the splits. Also, it's just, it's weird. I, like, I, I, I got a good amount of sleep. And maybe that's why. I feel like I'm definitely, like, I feel like when I actually do get, like, a normal amount of sleep, I feel tired. But when I don't get a normal, like, a good amount of sleep, I feel, like, half tired. But my body's like, okay, I'm used to this. <laughs> it's a little bit fucked up. But, yeah. Huh. <sighs> so. Ladies... And and gremlins, uh, if you're new here, which uh, I've been ner feeling nervous the whole weekend. Interviewed for a different position this last week, and they have yet to make an announcement. Well, definitely best of luck, Willie. I really hope that uh, that works out for you. I'm sure uh, once you get the news, you will feel a lot better. Um, yeah. 
So we've been we've been inching ever closer to 220, sub 220, uh, for beating Pokemon Red in I under can't two. Talk right now. Oh shit! I'm making piss. Joey, perfect. <laughs> Contraction was the one who showed me that meme. Wow, for 99 months. How you doing, man? I hope you're doing well. <laughs> that was the Doom Slayer going, wow. Yes, it was perfect for you. I had to change the music because uh, it's, um, what do you call it? Uh, the original has uh, Breaking Benjamin, and that would, like, DMCA every single stream that I do. <laughs> so, all right. So yes, we are trying to beat this game in under two hours and 20 minutes. I think we can do it in under two hours and 15, seeing as the gold pace is 2.11.11. But I will be happy today if we can beat this motherfucker in under two hours and 20 minutes. So that's just what we're gonna do. So let's do it. Let's fucking do it. Okay. First things first, we gotta name I think you can in under two. I think I can too, man. But I, I'm so worried about like you know with Bomberman. It just it was so fucking, it was such a slog, you know. But like the big thing is like I've really wanted to get to a point where I have this run memorized, and I pretty much do now. I pretty much have this whole two and a half hour run, uh, up in the noggin, um, which is saying a lot. Like this isn't like Banjo Kazooie, it, you know, where it's just like okay, go here, go here, go here. Every single trainer has a very specific set of moves, and like there's, you know, that you're supposed to do against them. Um, is RNG mostly controlled in this run? Not really. That's that's what kind of sucks about it. Um, I wanted to run Glitchless Classic because I wanted to essentially feel like I'm not doing any hard resets or doing anything that's really, uh, you know, like ob ob obliterating the game with with uh, RNG manipulation and glitches and stuff. Yeah. <sighs> no manips in the root. Yeah, there's no manipulations. Um, no pokey, no pokey doll bullshit. Um, I do a few insta texts, but that that's usually just it just happens. Um, I, yeah, no rats. Hopefully, there's no rats and no women. God damn, we've just been seeing an onslaught of women, and they just slow they just slow the run down. Honestly. You know? All right, anyway, here we go. Three, two, one, suck a dick. No bitches. <laughs> no bitches. <laughs> Hopefully not. <laughs> yeah, no rats or women allowed in this run. Strict, strict ratless, womanless run. Just like my life. Mm -mm. And being able to catch the uh, what have been the most interesting uh, potholes in the run, um, uh, difficult, mostly just like Misty. <laughs> Misty is a very uh, interesting hole in this run because Misty has the M Misty can very easily just destroy the run if she decides to. All she needs to do is get a critical bubble beam, and then it's over. Misty has kind of been the main issue, and there's not really much you can do about that other than just save before her and hope for better moves that she does against you. But like at that point, when you have a Nitto King and he and she's got bubble beam that can, you know, I, I think two bubble beams even without criticals will usually faint you. But that's also earlier than, um... Before you said Oak was, uh, in your house, but to me it looks like he was peeping on your mom. No, Oak, Oak isn't a fucking peeping Tom. Yo, shit's rad. Well, take it. I've been so much for 32 months. I'm gonna be your bubble beam bitch. I just, I wish, I wish somebody would be my bubble beam bitch. Somebody would look at me the way that Misty looks at me as she ends my whole life. Got a growl, but it failed. I'll do another one. I got that one. I can be arranged. All right. Be -ne 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 -ne. 
So for the Bulbasaur fight, we we usually want to uh, get one Tail Whip off to ensure that we we beat him. Um, but if he does growl at first, we usually want to do two Tail Whips. But his first his first growl didn't uh, work, but then he growled and that one worked. So it's gonna be uh, it might be a little bit tight. Looks like he missed. Just need one more on him. And he's down. Both sort of shredding that harmonica. Fucking wish. Wish I could shred harmonica. Smell you later. <laughs> this game's gonna give me a fucking thumb carpal tunnel. Whatever the the carpal in my fucking thumb is. I'm just mashing through menus. Looks like we got rats! Call the exterminators. Scurvy? Is that... That's not what scurvy is. Oops all rats. Yeah, this is the oops all rats run. This <laughs> rats, rats, weird rats. Mm. Rat attack only run when, when I have a full day to really dedicate to murdering my channel. You've got to be kidding me! This is alarming. <laughs> <laughs> this is alarming. Six encounter run is real. It might be. And this is three, and we have to we have to go through this area three times. You have to get a perfect Nidoran? Yeah, because that's how this works. The game's gonna feel bad once we get to Nidoran. Maybe maybe it's like a, it, it's like a, what do you call it? Like, it's a test. It's all a test, you know? It's like, I'm gonna give you shit RNG in the beginning for like the craziest good run, and only the weakest will reset beforehand. You know, level five Nidoran? Oh my God. Okay. I think that was the first time I went through grass and didn't see uh, an encounter. The <laughs> seven encounter? I mean, it could be. We gotta go back up one more time. Counters, does it become a reset? Honestly, it probably should already be a reset right now, but I don't I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get that crazy. I can't I actually like I can't remember where's the uh where's the time save from Friday's run? Because uh we are playing against Friday's run right now. First encounter Nidoran, that would be nice. We we kinda need it. Six encounters, so we've had four. Alright. Okay. See, I think the game feels bad. Holy shit! All right, like I said, now the game's giving us the 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 best RNG. It's like you've passed the test, where we give you a fucking <laughs> we throw a Pokemon at you, fucking every five seconds. Come 
Come on. Rat. <laughs> oh, rats. No women, no men. We gotta catch that. Oh, we missed. So I'll try again. Oh my god. Alright, just throw a Pokeball at it. Fuck it. Nope. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> Didn't need to hit it or anything. Just <laughs> fucking get on it. Like, I just, uh, he's like, I'll just get in the ball. I just have to ask nicely. There's my boy. Okay, this Squirtle sucks. This Squirtle sucks really bad. What the fuck is happening? Squirtle can't fucking land anything. Alright, we're in there. You adopted the blind one! <laughs> oh no. Alright, that's fine. I'm just gonna cope. The beginning of the run is just so RNG heavy, so I think, you know, I mean, I think the run we were going against was either an 8.30 or an 8.50, so we'd, uh, so we'd still kind of be pretty close to where we were there. Encounters. Some frame perfect movement. So far, so good. Yeah. I think we're good. Oh, fucked it up at the end there. But we might still get lucky. Very low on health because Squirtle can't fucking hit the broadside of a fucking burger barn. Uh, I'll do. I'll put in my first toe up here. Okay, I'm in potion now. Where the fuck are the Pokemon? That's an actual movement manipulation that I did. Hopefully the Nidoran doesn't have bad DVs. It, yeah. Again, because this Squirtle has ass DVs, um, I'm assuming that the game feels bad for me. <laughs> and, and Nidoran is gonna be a fucking god. Beginning of the run, and I don't know if Silphco was still a bad part of the run, but... Yeah, no, I think Silphco is okay. There was some silliness. I can't remember what it was. Uh, there's there's definitely time save at Agatha. I, I do know that. He didn't poison me, which was really quite nice of him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Agatha has actually been kind of a run ruiner and uh, it has been more or less my fault. So like the Agatha fuck up um, yesterday was I, I used the wrong move um, and that kind of broke the broke kind of the order of everything that was happening. minute to beat Brock. I don't think it can happen, but I'm gonna do my best. That felt like a slow Weedle fight. I 
Brock is kind of a, it feels like a longer fight too because we this is the only run or this is the only fight in the run that we're doing a lot of like switch out tactics. It just feels like the 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 battle just drags. Get Squirtle to spit on Brock. Yeah, I'm already fucking that up. Squirtle hit with that one. Please don't miss. Thank you. <laughs> By differential of we It's true. Go. Ah. Uh. Nidoran, look at this onyx. Yo, you, know, you want to know something fucking crazy to think about? How many of you guys thought Onyx was spelled with a Y? It's fucking not. It's always been spelled with an I. It's alright, it is the rock. A lot of people, a lot of people remember very distinctly Onyx being spelled with a Y. It's widely considered a, a Pokemon uh, M Mandala, Mandela effect. Mandala. Never thought Onyx was the, the Y? Oh, well. My apologies, superior Pokemon fan. Yep, Pikachu with, uh, Pikachu's never had black tip on the tail. That's another one. happening. Okay. Nope. <laughs> I'd like to buy 99, please. <laughs> I need 99 potions. 50 burgers, 50 fries, 50, 100. Bella effect is when something is fractally wound. Fractally round. What? The man the mandala f Oh right, because of a mandala. The mandala effect, yeah, gotcha. <laughs> 99 potions, 99 fries, 99 burgers, 99 pies. <laughs> Realizing he can't afford it. No, he just runs in, he's just like, fuck! I need all these potions! I think Weedle can fuck me up, so I'm gonna potion. It is very silly that in this run, the scariest Pokemon are like Weedle and Starmie. That's about it. I mean, Starmie makes sense, but Weedle. <laughs> potions, uh, bottles, uh, potions on the wall. 98 bottles of potions on the wall. 98 bottles of potions. Take one down, potion seller. My, these potions will kill you, traveler. You cannot handle my potions. They are too strong. There's a hor uh, horned worm that's bigger than your arm. Yeah, it is scary. For sure. Potion seller. I need only your strongest potions. Let's go to the person sized mantis with literal blames blades for his arms. Luckily we don't see him. Great video right next to shit hard, yeah. Have you have you got all seen uh, my uh Potion Seller Metal Remix that I put out like a week ago. Figured a lot of a lot of you guys probably didn't see it because it's on the second channel that hasn't uh, 
seen any videos in fucking forever. Saw it, fuck yeah. I'm very proud of it. Tyranitar isn't Gen 1. Yeah. Yeah, we're not gonna see Tyranitar for sure. Dead. Yeah. Weedle. Ratatat. Scariest Pokemon. Ekans. Ekans is scary. Dragonite? No, Dragonite's a bitch. We we one shot Dragonite. It's not been getting any love. I'm hoping to put um highlights of these streams on there. It's just tough because like I feel like the highlights never really do that well. And it's kinda it's a lot of work for not a really a lot of a lot of return, but I'm trying to figure out ways to make it a little bit easier. Because I do like I do like making them and I do like I did like hiring out to have people like make them, but I just felt like wasn't really it didn't really feel like it was going anywhere highlights are fun i like i really like the idea of just like you know having like these almost like long-standing series that i can that i can just have a ton of content for Holy shit. And then that's gonna be the last one he's gonna do rap again, I guarantee you. Yeah, this is so fucking stupid. And I didn't I didn't land a Leer, otherwise that would have done more damage, I think. There's a YouTube channel for gaming. I thought there was only music. Uh, there's my second channel, Jules Conroy. I was doing um, highlights of these streams and stuff. And I've already, I've already like cut up a lot of the first streams for Pokemon. So they're like, I mean, ideally I could just fucking ed edit them out myself. Yeah, it also has the doorbell video. The, the great, the great legend. Remember doorbell? Yeah, that was on the second channel. My favorite was the lick. Yeah, that was fun. Mayonnaise one. Yeah, I I, I thought the mayonnaise one would have uh, inspired more people, but I feel like that one that one didn't quite take off the way I thought it would. But. That channel really is just for fucking around anyway. But it's kind of like also for me just like the the like I have this really stupid idea that I think like might do well, but then when I think like oh it might do well, like I, I start to get like invested in it or something. But the whole point of the second channel really was to just be like, okay, I don't care about these videos like I do family jewels, just put out whatever I want. The shit post channel. That was the idea. This and Duran has shit DVs, I can already tell. I guess I attack 17. When you become a Pokemon, which would you be? Uh, Gardevoir or Vaporeon? But like I would be Vaporeon, but ooh, nice. Uh, I'd be I'd be Vaporeon, but like be wearing like an FBI uh, wire, so that when a trainer tries to fuck me, I'll be like, all right, you're caught in 4K, bitch. You're going to jail. We got Spiro this run, right? Like I'm I'm not I'm 99.9% .9 sure we did that, but oh fuck, that was stupid. Operations Gardevoir, yeah. I'd be the Mew, the Jesus of Pokemon, yeah. We had one tackle, and then finish horn attacks, but we're gonna get to the end of these horn attacks and not have anything left. Got 
one more. That Metapod make a ghastly sound? Probably. I'm kind of fucking up the game with the, the red bar shit. Okay, so it would be sick. I think there's definitely like... There's definitely like a minute of time save in Mount Moon, right? I mean, we had a minute of time save on Route 3, but alas. Hey, points of Zion. I didn't notice that. In what ways is it different? Some just slowed down. Yeah, well, so I think some of them just are straight up the same thing. At least it seems like that. Okay, how much time is that? There's only 48 seconds of time save here. But I think... W wasn't this, like, horrible? This was, like, horrible in, la in the last run. We saw, like, every fucking Pokemon here. It's pussy is bigger than the Japanese releases. Okay. Like, Vaporeon's? Vaporeon's pussy? Are you talking about Vaporeon's pussy? Like, 15 encounters? Yeah. Oh! We got Paris. Encounter to Paris. That's fucking... That's insane. And I killed it. Fuck. We'll see another one. I feel it. I can feel it. <laughs> Sick. It's alright. I didn't like that Paris. I wasn't feeling his vibe. It's it's just RNG manipulation to kill the first Paris you see, don't you know? <laughs> Oh, was tasty. Got a little crit there. A little critty. A little critterous. <laughs> this Nidoran doesn't hit for shit. I will tell you that right now. And he doesn't seem to get a whole lot of like extra criticals or anything. I think this guy I think this this Nidoran just fucking blows dick. When you don't want it, yeah. Geodude, what are you doing with those fucking wacky arms, huh? Like fucking slap against the the wall arms toy. That's what your arms look like here. What the fuck? The bad Nidoran, yeah. When would you not want to blow dick? I, that's true. You got me there. Dude, dude saluting me. He's like, hello, comrade. I feel like that's like the first Zubat. No, no, no the, first, the first encounter was a Zubat. Just, I feel like... I'm usually fucking <laughs> exhausted looking at Zubat's stupid face by now. Yeah, if you're gonna blow dick, you might as well do it well. It's not gay to suck dick, it's gay to suck dick poorly. <laughs> so, if a girl is sucking your dick, boys, men, uh, and it's bad, sorry to tell you, but that's some gay, that's some gay dick sucking. You are gay now. Stop absorbing me. See this oddish. Amazing blowjob. Is it gay to have sex with men? I don't think so. Legitimately, I don't think it's really that gay. Back to the being gay talking gay. Being gay talking gay makes you speedrun better. I mean, 
Correlational, but maybe not causational. De <laughs> Lightly fucked olive oil. <laughs> yeah. We ain't got any extra virgin here. We're just out here fucking olive oil. Extra slutty olive oil. That's right. I really hate that, Matthew. Gently used hot dogs. Don't worry, we're gonna see another Paris. Like, I feel it in here. There's another Paris that's just like, calling my name. Partially used dick, yeah. guys hear the one about the uh, the guy who um, goes to the urinal and he's at the urinal next to his friend Gary and he looks down and he sees that Gary has a huge fucking cock like insanely big dick like he's just like god I just I it's it's just I'm sorry it's 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 beautiful it's just it's glorious and he's like oh thanks he's like you know he, he's just like I do what, what do you do? What do you do to to get to get that? And he's like, oh well, you know, I you know just I have this weird thing where I uh, every night before I go to bed, um, I go up to my bed, uh, I go up to the bedpost and I slap the bedpost with my cock three times, um, and I don't know, it, it's just it's something that you know I, I've always done might might help or whatever and he's like oh shit okay well i mean i might as well try it what do i have to lose so sure enough um this man goes goes to bed um that night he's about to get in, get in bed with his wife and he's like all right well guess i'll give it a try so he goes up to the bedpost slaps it with his cock three times and then his wife kind of like stirs he's like gary is that you Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Polygam polygamy, <laughs> yes. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, it's just a Mormon household. There's nothing fun about it. Uh, there's nothing funny about it. It's just, it's just a good old wholesome household where lots of wives or lots lots of husbands. I thought I don't I don't know anything about that. I don't know. Anything. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna talk about things I don't know anything about. It. I only know about penis. <laughs> this need a rant sucks. It's king time, bitches. Hail to the king. It, so, if he's got low DVs, at least we, like, we know, you know? And we can work with that. This is Paris. Fuck. You just remind me that I saw A7X last week and that shit went crazy. Oh, fuck. I'm seeing them in two weeks? One week? One week. I think I'm seeing them Saturday. Which is crazy because I'm seeing Sleep Token on Tuesday. Hail to the King Live is so fucking good. Maybe I'll, I don't know. Hail to the King was a weird one for me. I didn't, I didn't really enjoy that album as much as like the other ones. I loved the stage. Um, damn, I'm getting pounded by Grimer. I mean, you can't be mad at that face. Um, but very excited to hear some of the uh, 
Life's but a dream songs. Musicians go see musicians. Yeah, I think you gotta. Like you're really, like it's it's important. You know, like crime is ready to suck. Hands up. Time for a suck. This Bo Dream is such a good album. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. There's a lot of really, really cool things going on there. I don't think I liked it as much as the stage, but um, I think it's still a good album. I liked it. I liked it better than Hail to the King. This is Paris right here. Maybe the Paris, the Paris was just scared. He was just shy, but he let it be known. He was the perfect Paris for me, but we never saw him. He's just going to live inside that Mount Moon forever. I really got to stop fucking poison singing Paris. I'm always just like, yeah, Paris is like a poison type Pokemon. This won't do too much damage, and then it just always fucking ends it. I, just, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what Pokemon are. Yeah, it's gonna be a weed run. 420, baby. Weed! Ash loves smoking weed. He takes his Oddish and smokes him up. Put that Oddish inside that J. Smoke that Oddish every day. Poison is quite effective in this gen too. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking obliterates him. I'm just like, fuck. You gotta tackle Paris. That's the way to do it. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hit, yo! Ah! It's like saying Ayo, but backwards. He goes, yo, ah. <laughs> Faster than Pidgeotto though. Maybe this, maybe this uh, Nidoran's got some good speed, which would be very good against, uh... nice, okay. Would be very good against Alakazam later on. Oh wait, we don't have to worry worry about it's still outspeeding me. <laughs> like <laughs> even with an X speed. Speed racer Nitto King. Yeah. I mean he he is going first a lot, which is kinda sick. You get to name your rivals Pokemon. That would be sick. Yeah. Will that huff the frame, the, huff the fumes of vile plume to get high in the Pokemon world? Oh, absolutely. So, Janifee. How's it going so far? Not super great, but um, it's not so bad that we should reset. We had a really rough. Uh, um, the first split looks bad. It was mostly uh, Route 3 was kind of annoying because we died to Shorts Guy. Made us eat his shorts. This is Nugget Bridge. A bridge made of nuggets. Yeah, I did also kill Paris. But I, I'm telling you, man, I felt I felt that there was the perfect Paris in there, and that just wasn't it. That Paris just, you know, it wasn't it wasn't gonna suffice. Route 1 didn't have any encounters on the on the way up. The first way up was awful. I think we saw, like, what, four Pokemon? Then we saw one on the way back, and it was just, yeah. The entire city of Paris, yeah. <laughs> okay, you got me. I just killed that one Paris. Guys, Jules fucking committed genocide to every Paris in Mount Moon. Oh, okay, I guess you're right. Maybe I'm just being a little bit silly. Why is she angry? Oh, sorry. Happy face. <laughs> EBA, thank you so much for the 39 months. Appreciate it. I think there's a perfect Paris. That that one wasn't good enough. That's a little parasocial of you. Is that is that really parasocial? 
I don't know if it is. Genocide, more like girl bossing. <laughs> Ooh! One shot that fucking Nidoran. That was good. Here's number three. Imagine finding a shiny in this run. There aren't shinies in Gen 1, are there? I feel like that's a thing they added way later. But that would be cool. <laughs> like, anyway, we just see a glitched fucking, like, Paris. And it's just like the, the, the thing got corrupted or something. Shinies technically exist based on DV. Oh, so so it's like not like a like a legitimate like um their their uh sprite is shiny. Missing no is the closest thing we have to a shiny. Eh, not really. It's not a visual thing in Gen 1. They become shinies when transfer Gen 2. Oh shit. I didn't know I don't know about that. Only this bull when you transfer it. Uh, I gotcha. Shiny Hunt Mew 2 in Gen 1. It's based on Saz. That's cool. I wonder if because this run isn't as like uh, muscle memory based, if it, if it's like an easier run to memorize for like, you know what I mean? So like. If you don't run it for a while, if you can run it again, like, no problem. This Nugget Bridge has been actually pretty good so far. I mean, we're, we're past all the parts where it's... Anything can go wrong, so... But they're, they're just... I feel like there just isn't, like, a lot of potential time save here. It's possible for Moltres especially to have stats on it for it. It's, it's just crazy now that I've played this game so many times now, like this that there's any more Pokemon in the game than Nidoran and Nidoking. I, I'm, Nid, Nidorino goes by so fast, I barely even, barely even notice. You beat our five contest trainers. You just earned my dick. You don't, you don't need anything other than Nidoking to finish this game. I'm proving it. I'm fucking proving this shit. It's weird that he's got a whip and also like a fucking Mario glove. And he's got like four fingers. DB's determined whether it's shiny and what letter unknown it is. Ooh, I didn't know that about the unknown. That's cool. <laughs> yeah, his Team Rock appearance game. Yeah. Are you, did you just try to fucking L MLM me into fucking Team Rocket? Yeah, that was good. Saved, saved pretty much all the time that there was to save there, I feel like. But yeah. I think I think we can very easily rock this back. Um, if Misty's good to us, we'll be pretty close to um, on the money. But assuming Misty will be good to us. Fuck. I made a grave error. It's alright. Now we're gonna be red barred, right? One more, one more. Hard did you hit yourself? Holy shit! Holy shit! I was like, all I need is one fucking hit. Critical confuse hit? Yeah. He's like, it hurt himself and it. <laughs> I just, I, I can't believe we witnessed that. Nitto King just was just like, I'm very confused and pulls out a gun and fucking all, unalives himself right there. I'm just a little bit confused right now. Fuck. 
All right. Yeah, noodling murked himself. It, it that was it, it was it was alarming because I was like, oh, he hurt him. He hit himself. It's gonna be like what, like five damage? It, it, his hit himself did like thirty-one damage, right? Didn't he have like thirty-one health at that point? He just one shot himself. That was insane. Maybe his, his attack his attack was only high when hitting himself. That's that's what that stat was. That's what we learned. All right, that Nidoran ran was shit. It was a terrible first split, and Route One was god awful. I, I was honestly just trying to get through it so that we didn't reset, but then I did the thrash instead of water gun. Common mistake. <laughs> really was the perfect Nido King. All right. You know what? You know what would help this run a lot. I'll tell you. I will tell you. One little dog. Little dog. Ah, oh, shoot, I gotta go. That's exactly what Nitto King said in that last run. Little dog is what we need for this run. Isn't that right, baby? All right, you wanna you wanna count it off? Good girl! <laughs> she did it! She fucking did it! What is your name? Yuna. Yuna. My name is my name is Yuna. I remember now. His name is Ah. Yoon A. <laughs> hey, wait, don't go out, Oak said to Ash's mom when finding a man way closer to her age and maturity. Uh, did you see the latest episode of Gold Man and White Haired Gal? Gold Man. Who is Gold Man? I feel like we do this every... Every stream. Oh, C-3PO. I mean, I feel like that implies that he's in more episodes than just the one. Yeah, I did see it. I like how everyone's just like, Ahsoka's so good, we should just ignore the sequels and just call this the sequels. <laughs> I think Ahsoka's good, but I'm, you know. I'm actually, I'm watching, um, I'm watching Clone Wars right now. Mostly because, like, I'm just like, it, like, watching everybody, like, be so fucking hype about like oh my god these characters in real life like it's so crazy like it's cool you know what i mean so i i, I kind of want to i want to experience that myself it's never gonna be better than clone wars clone wars is like already like i'm on episode like nine season one it's already pretty good like i I really enjoy the fact that it's like because it's animated, there's like a lot more room to be like, oh, let's focus more on a story that makes any fucking sense. Sequels to Star Wars? No. Yeah, it's called it's called Baby Yoda Show. Grogu. How many how many pets do you think people named their pets Grogu? Glup Shitto. It's called yeah, it's called Glup Shitto. That's you you could have been named Glup Shitto. How do you feel about that? 
Glop. Glop. She's answering to it. <laughs> she knows her other name. <laughs> Shit, Glupper. Yeah. I'm gonna name my firstborn son Grogu. What if he looks like Grogu? He pops out of the fucking Bulba. It's all green and fucking big-eared and shit. Gooey. Oh, I guess he's not really that gooey in the show. Well, sometimes he's gooey. A bonus. <laughs> I feel like, listen, like... Oh, here we go. Baby Yoda is, is cute. But if that was your son, I think he'd be a little, uh... Pops out with a lightsaber. Fuck yeah. Okay. Green hat? What? <laughs> Grogu with a green hat. I'm trying to think of, like, a common green hat. All I can think of is there's probably, like, fucking green monster from Fenway Park hats. They're probably green. <laughs> Din Djarin took him in, so would I, yeah. Such a softy, that Pedro Pascal. <laughs> I am your child. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Love that. Much better. Much better than the last run, that's for sure. Hello, puppy. It's because the puppy's here, I told you. Puppy. into the camera. I know, it's like perfect. Oh, she's falling asleep now. <laughs> you were the chosen one. No, you were the chosen one. Out of all the sperm, you were the one who survived. You were the chosen one. And you know who chose you? You did. <laughs> Don't underestimate my power. Imagine how big he is when hard. Baby Yoda? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, you're talking about Pedro Pascal. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Damn, imagine Baby Yoda, but hard. <laughs> Where's your head at? We're talking about Baby Yoda. Hard Yoda. Hard and Baby Yoda. Ooh. Ooh, baby. Ugh. Oh, fuck. No. Come back when you're older. Yolo ball in it. Oh, okay. Vividly really describe Yoda's sex life. Why not? How many people speedrun this? It's a game from my childhood as well. Yeah, I love this game. All right, I'll tackle it. Fuck. time. Alright, we're a little bit red, but you know what? Like, it's fine. Because it's way better than the last run where we were a minute, <laughs> we're minute red. But even then, it's like, yeah, 748 coming out of the first split is not, not unmanageable. 
Oh, fuck. Woman! Yeah, significantly less red. But still Pokemon red. Yeah, every time I get a red split, it's on purpose. I'm just, I'm being, I'm, I'm being, uh, you know, on brand for the game. Pokemon Green. There's a good pet the puppy section of the run. Better color, yeah. I also think Nidorana is more common in red. Gold splits only for Pokemon Gold, yeah. Oh, bye, Yuna. She just fucking leapt. Nidoran M more common in red, and blue is more Nidoran female. Gotcha. A <laughs> new freedom of her is true. Be free, little one. Oh, she's having her, one of her little bully sticks. She's getting dick breath. <laughs> Lou would utilize the Blastoise route. Maybe. Bully stick breath sucks. It's literally dick. Like, bully sticks are, are literal penises. How is I not red barred? I guess maybe it's like four? Four out of 27 I'd be in red bar? Really? Interesting. Okay. They are just bullcock. Yeah, it's, it's literally just bull penis. Not have a bird this time, so we gotta get a bird after uh, during Route 3. Humans eat bull testicles. Is that a, is that a, is that something people eat? Like bull bull balls? Bull balls? Balls of the bull? I can't imagine it's called like bull testes. Rocky Mountain Oysters? What? <laughs> They're called oysters? What? Did not know that. Bull pussy, however. Yeah. Rocky Mountain Oysters are fried and breaded bull balls. <laughs> So not all oysters, because pretty sure oysters come from a different place. Sometimes they're pounded flat. That just sounds rude. <laughs> it's like, why do we gotta why do we gotta pound the balls flat? Well, I guess it makes them easier to Oh fuck. Alright, well, that's a fuck up. That's fine. Please don't kill him. Okay. I want mine full of cum. Yeah, do they have to remove the cum? <laughs> Cowboy caviar. That just sounds like a fucking... I don't know, that sounds like a euphemism. Gave that girl a cowboy caviar. Caviar. 
maybe would have saved more time if uh, if I didn't accidentally say no to not switching out the Pokemon. What about a reverse? What about a reverse cowgirl caviar? What's that? It's always the most cursed conversation. I feel like that's my whole stream. My whole stream is a cursed conversation all the time. What's up, Joey? How you doing? If you have to ask, you can't afford it. True. Like I'm, I'm desperate to fucking bring this like crazy green at the end of this. I think what'll help is if we just all caterpie, all caterpies and weedles. Or no, I think we definitely for the first few have to leer horn attack because otherwise, like, I mean. Uh, Nidoran's very underleveled for these first few fights. Yeah, it's already October. I don't think this Nidoran has uh, very good attack DVs either. Attack 15. I wonder if there, is there like a is there like a fucking resource to see like whether or not DVs are good for Nidoran. Like, what's on, like, the higher echelon as opposed to, like, low tier? DD breast creep me out? What? Don't... What? <laughs> Some IVs for later gens, yeah. There's gotta be, like, yeah, like a, a thing that says, like, this is within the realm of good or not. Certain stat trackers. Th yeah, I have a stat tracker for this, but it's so in detail that, like, I can't, <laughs> I can't even, like, I, d I don't know. Like, it definitely feels like not, it, it doesn't feel like anything I should be using until I'm, like, getting, like, sub fucking two or something. Plug some stuff in. Sure, as well. I appreciate that. I just want to know if 15 attack is lower or higher for a uh, higher attack for uh, Nid Nidoran at level nine. Because like, if I have a better idea of like what the range is, I feel like I can. Um, better uh, prepare right. red bard now uh, I'm gonna try to r rock the red bar through this oh wait we leveled up so it's gone now don't wrap don't wrap don't wrap don't wrap thank you now you just have to don't wrap again you fucker I can't click on links right now. This fucking Ekans has been really mean to me today. Yeah, we got it. We definitely, if we want to get like a gold route three, we definitely have to get better luck on that Ekans. Plus, like, I think a, a gold, a gold route three is probably going to be one where we had gotten the bird in the first split. I'm going to leer and tackle these guys. 
Leer Double Tackle should be able to take out all of these Weedles and Caterpies um, and save us some Horn Attacks so that we don't, uh, so that we can beat uh, Metapod faster. Metapod and Kakuna. <gasps> Good is 17. 15 attack at level 9 is bad. Okay. Yeah, I, I can kind of see that. Good is 17. Oh, it's a demon. For 17, you run this? Hell yeah. Appreciate that, Ezreal. 16 to 17 is where you want to be? Okay. At level 9? Okay. So we're, 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 running, we're running a pretty low attack Nidoran for this run. I think we're good. 11 horn sacks. They're just not hitting hard. It's just not good enough. Alright, there we go. Rex Rath, thanks so much for the raid. Hope you had a good stream. This is your only Pokemon run? Oh! <gasps> I thought we just fought the second. I just. I'm sorry. No, it wasn't you. I thought we. I thought we just fought uh, the guy over here, and I had to go down. It's all right. Shitty, shitty Nidoran. Shitty Nidoran. It's fine. No, nothing. Nothing of, of value is lost. Nothing of value is lost. All right. Um. Maybe if I search uh, Nido Ran DVs Gen One. Okay, now <laughs> shit ran. DB calculator. Uh, Nido Ran Nido Ran boy. Low end of DVs, no more than like six. Uh, let me see if Nidoran DVs good Gen One. Oh, you can use Red Classic Helper. I do have that. Um, it's a DV checker. All right. Let me see if I can utilize it. I feel like I'm now. I like I. I have it, but I've always kind of just been like, ah, I don't fucking know what I'm doing with it. Um, I even have like a little like thing for DVs on on here. Uh, let's see if I can find. That's it. Pokemon Red Red Helper 107. So like, does this also like essentially tell me like, uh, whether or not they're good or not? <laughs> I'll try to utilize it, but yeah, here we go. So if I pop this up, I should yeah, I have this all here. It is gonna get in the way of the the the, the time though. Is this unreadable if I put it like this? That's fine. Okay. I can kind of read it on uh, on read it on mobile. Okay. Easily readable. Okay. If you say so. If I move this slightly up, it kind of fucks everything up a little bit. Oh, actually, I could probably do something like this. Yeah. Okay. Let's see.
Bridge candies after after second. Strats. I don't know what the fuck. Like, there's all these, like, options on here. Original level 3 or original level 4. Okay, yeah. So I see it looks like... What is this on the, on the, on the left here? HP, defense, speed, spell. Okay. Yeah, it's first run of the day. How do you update it? It like it has like um I have to I have to like manually do it I think. Uh edit my expects for so far. Prefer four paralyzed heal. I don't know what like so many of these things are. That's why I kinda haven't really like used it that much. Oh yeah, oh cool, and then there's a little thing for the for the decim. For the decim. Alright, I'll try to utilize this. Let's see what happens. Yeah, you have to manually input it. It's cool, though. Try finger butthole. Yeah, that's true. You gotta manually do that. You gotta manually try finger butthole. Okay. This one's gonna be a winner. Well, we'll know if it's not. <laughs> Maybe. Alright, here we go. Three, two, one, go. You know why that run died? Yuna jumped off my lap. Isn't that right, Yuna? You ruined everything, didn't you? Very cute, though. Pets plus the RNG, yeah. I opened up Grinder. This is to earn. It died because of me. No, I'm telling you, it's not your fault. But if you're insistent, then fine, yeah. Why Why did you do that? Why did you ruin my run? Why did you just come in here and just fucking fuck the whole thing up, huh? The frick. Fucking a big old dick. Fucking a big old dick. It's a sabotage, all right. <laughs> sabotage. When I was young, I was serious about Pokemon, and then I took an arrow in the knee. Fuck! My finger was not on the controller. So you want the water Pokemon? Squirtle? Did you know that squirting is just piss? <laughs> Thank you, Professor Oak. How'd you find- You know what? Don't tell me how you found that out. Your mother! Okay. Thank you. Mm, squirting is just piss. Yeah, squirting is just piss. Yeah. No squirting in this chat. Yeah. Well, if a guy comes and pisses, then he's he's squirting by definition. That's a squirting man. I don't know if that's true or if that's a Sharpio fact. Let me put it into perspective for you. Let's imagine a world where a woman exists, first of all, and second of all, squirts. Where's the... Where, where's that squirt coming from? Where's the... Where's the fucking... Where's the bag? Where's the where's the, the bag of squirt juices? From her balls. Alright, I'm wrong. Sorry. I, you know, I can admit when I'm wrong. Imagine having to get a Pokedex to learn about squirting. Yeah, Professor Oak is like, here's a Pokedex, and here's a special Pokedex. It's got a lot of special moves. With lots of PP. Can you imagine a Pokedex where, like, you were, like, I don't know, watching porn and then it's just, like, the Waffle Stomp? 
Actually, I guess waffle stomping isn't really a sex move, is it? Well, I guess it can be. Anything can be a sex move. The Baltimore Brownie. The Donkey Punch. The Tallahassee, <laughs> Tallahassee Trombone. The Rusty Trombone. Waffle Stomp is what I heard. Yeah, if you go to Waffle House and ask for a Waffle Stomp, um, they'll know what you mean. Squirting was stored in the Pokedex. Oh, thank you. Well, hi there, Ash. What is your Pokedex smell like piss? On Pornhub on the DS internet browser, yeah. What's up, Uncle Larry? Hentai Haven on the Wii U. Damn. We're really, we're really pulling out the nostalgia here. I don't think I've ever looked at porn on a Nintendo device. Now, PlayStation Portable. <laughs> I don't think I played any games on that thing. The only game was Spanking the Monkey. PSP has records? What do you mean? And Nintendo doesn't? Is hentai heaven or rhythm heaven bootleg? Yeah. Records of what you've done? Listen, you know what? I'm not ashamed of the, sh of the things I look at. Talk about porn? Never mind. What do you mean? I feel like when the PSP came out, like, there were so, there were so few, like, portable devices that can access the internet, you know? Like, unless you had a fucking, like, Palm Pilot, if you want to look at porn, you gotta fucking, you gotta tuck in your fucking computer chair to do so. Ooh! Good RNG. I think we only saw, what, two? Yeah, very nice RNG. Very happy with that. Bad RNG for the rest of the game. True. It's track of all the people who looked up porn on their devices for... What are they going to do with that? That's just a waste. I don't know. People are just so worried about, like, their privacy and, like, oh, no, someone's going to find out. I watch step-sibling porn. It's like, no one gives a shit. So maybe your step-sibling. Step-sibling probably would be... would definitely give shits about that. Rats! I'm gonna watch the- yeah. <laughs> it's the only reason that they, like, track all the porn you watch is because they're looking for good porn themselves. Alright, we're catching that. God damn, Squirtle. Calm down. I'm trying to catch him, not end his life. I must be disappointed then. Why, you don't look at any crazy porn? I feel like from everybody's perspective, their porn is crazy. Because, like, you literally are, like, watching it at at both at both points. Like, I'm horny, and I have... And then you come, and then you're just like, you know, where do we go when we die, etc. <laughs> Going through all that shit. Post-nut post, post, uh, post -nut clarity. Only redheads... That's sick. You know, maybe someone at Nintendo would like fucking wants, wants some new redhead porn. Like, I wouldn't know where to find specifically redhead porn. Who is the, who is the one who said bad RNG for the rest of the run? Cause ding, ding, ding. You might be onto something. Oh my God. Oh my god. 
This place looks like fucking Europe during the fucking Black Death right now. Not great, but we can work with it. Is Manip not allowed in this run? Uh, which one? The the crazy one where you like save beforehand and just do the movement like exactly perfect. I think it's allowed, um, but it's a li like I'm still very new at this run, so it's it, it's very particular. No, Red Helper doesn't sync to the game. That's what's kind of frustrating. I have to input it manually, which. If I, if I just, like, right now, just kind of fucking, you know, start using it slowly, eventually I'll get good at it. It's not something you've learned yet. What the fuck? See, this is supposed to be movement manip, you know? Like, I've seen it and I've tried it, but, like, the big thing is just, like, it seems like there's a lot of elements to it that I'm, I'm not understanding. Like, there seems like there's, like, some button presses and stuff. <laughs> That whenever I'm looking at like input displays, they do like I don't know. There's just a lot of shit, you know. This is also like the first like fucking like 2D game I've ever speed ran. They almost like exclusively run like fucking 3D stuff. A lot of con confusing manipulate in red and blue, yeah. I feel like the, the reason I gravitated towards classic was I just wanted to, like, I don't know. I, I wanted to have, like, a, a more, um, you know, glitchless experience. No Squirtle BLJ. Yeah, I don't want Squirtle doing wahoo, wahoo, wahoo all over the place. You know, that 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 trick that everyone knows from Pokemon Red. <laughs> it's impossible to do glitchless. What do you mean? I mean, it might be. Come on! It's because it's you said that, Hog. There's a glitch in Misty City. I'm trying to think of the glitch. Is it is it like Nugget Bridge area or before that? Every time you miss tackle, it's a glitch. Every time I lose time to this run, it's a glitch. It's not me being bad. It's after dig. after dig. Like after you get dig? There's like an audio clip that's glitched so it pulls up the wrong audio file. Hmm. After obtaining dig. I do I do, do the the on the teleport thing, do the um what do you call it? The dig after you teleport so that it's faster and stuff. I guess that's technically a glitch, right? The main glitch. Yeah, that was a that was a glitch. Like when I went when I jumped over that wall. You're not supposed to be able to jump that wall, but uh, you know, I, I was trying to go for a sequence break, um, and uh, yeah. There's a glitch where it doesn't hit. Oh shit. 
speed. That's just how the game registers hits. Screech! Yeah. Onyx said. Squirtle yeah. said, "Calm down." Holy shit! What did Onyx said? Onyx said. That's what Onyx said. That was Screech. That's what Screech sounds like. I saw a 15. Like how your shirt is red? Thank you. So that people don't see me bleed. Sucking up upon a painting. Us for success. That's right. <laughs> Dress for suck. Yeah, it's a ruby shirt. The old arm still throbbing? Yeah, a little bit. The arms arm still hurts a bit from the tat. So, oh wait, we got 27 hit points. Wait, what? Confused. Oh, wait, fuck. This is really hard to fucking do both of these at the same time. It's level 8. I don't, I don't think I understand this, because... Level 9. 16, 14. shit means. Or I'm just doing it wrong. Should people input the stats during the movement or something that requires less focus and buttons? Gotcha. I'm trying to think of like another time that I can... So they just like kind of like memorize it or whatever? Bigger number good? I, th I assume so. You doing it wrong? Impossible? True. All right, Classic Helper, what's the... There's, like, the top row that has the, the little checks. I'm just trying to click in the numbers when I see, like... They know the stats and way... Oh, gotcha. No! Defense. Seems decent. Oh, look, I landed the, the leader.
Happy pumpkin spice latte season. Fuck yeah. All right, I think I'm I think I'm doing this wrong. Level. Glass bones and paper skin. I wanna. I just wanna make sure I'm doing this this right. DV calculation. The program will not only eliminate other possible DVs because something has to be odd or even, but also eliminates impossible DVs using this formula. Because of the limitations, there are only seven. <laughs> there are only seven thousand one hundred sixty-eight possible DV combinations. Good. J just that many. That's fine. Okay. This is this is like the way to the way to do it. Okay. So top panel. What? Oh, you're coughing. Okay. The, the program, okay, uh, select DVs yourself if you know them and or don't want to use the bottom area. Yeah, so what's the bottom area all about? That's, that's the shittos. Test on the starter, that's not how this, uh, the, this works. It's specifically on Nidoran because of this route. Um... Click what you see in game. The program will do math and eliminate impossible combinations. Select whatever you killed before Mount Moon and the program will add the stat experience in the appropriate level. Where? Oh, well, I guess it's assuming that I kill something before Mount Moon, but I usually get my first Pokemon during the first... Oh, no, that's for Squirtle. Are you supposed to kill something before Mount Moon? Select the Hiker checkbox, and it will add the extra stat experience on level 17. Select whether you kill... Uh... All the trainers. It accounts for run variations. Yeah, that's what it seems like to me. All right, ranges panel. This is able loads damage ranges from battles, blah, 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 blah. All the trainers after Brock. Well, like we have to beat them anyway. It's it's like selecting whether or not I kill a... Um, it seems like it, it's like I kill a, a wild Pokemon. Cause like the only ones under Route, route 3 are Pidgey and Spearow that I have options for, but obviously like Jigglypuff will spawn there. Your mom will spawn there. Yeah. She's having a little like uh she's having a little like a uh, coffin fit. Okay little girl. Okay little baby. What are we trying to do? I'm trying to utilize this uh this DV uh DV calculator. Um so uh it, it literally like it'll be like, okay, here's here's like what what's the original level of the Nidoran you catch? And then as you level up, you can level it up like this. And then, okay, yeah, the, my thing is like, I don't understand what screen are we looking at? No, that's the wrong one. Two. So here's, here's what I'm looking at right here. I don't know what these are on the side, but the idea is like, we catch Nidoran, uh, let's say we catch Nidoran level four, like we did before. And I guess when I'm on this level, I guess these are the different variations. It just, it seems, it seems weird. This is the DV level. When you, uh, 15 is the best. Okay. So the, I, so what I was doing when I saw it was like, if I just like, if I was like, Okay, level six, and then I saw 12 under attack. I just hit 12 here. Does it matter which one I select? Or like, 
Yeah, okay. How do I know what the DB is? Possible roll. Yeah, DBs or IVs in Gen 1. Just click one. Has you get more info, it eliminates bad choices, so like click twelve. Yeah. So it does that and then I and then I lose everything else and then when you level up, it's the stats. So I should probably Once I get Nidoran, I probably won't know its health until level eight, I'm guessing. But it could be any of these. You'll see different attack number to choose. Yeah. Okay, so I so I gotta be essentially memorizing way more than I am. I have to like look at it, remember the numbers, and then while I'm walking, pop these in. Remember its stats based on level ups. We'll remove the one is not good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that. Yeah, I got that. It's the part of the mill that's fucking with me. Alright. Try it again. So, so it, it doesn't matter which 12 in that, in that situation that I press, because it'll eventually realize it, right? Right, okay, right, that, that's what I was asking. So it, so I, I think what I said was it doesn't, does it matter which one I do? And you were like, yes, but it also doesn't matter. It, it matters, but it doesn't matter. As long as it's the number. Yeah, okay. All right. I think we're good. Fuck. Hello. No. I don't wish to play Pokemon right now. I wish to play Pokemon in just a second. <laughs> Hello there. I think Ian McGregor would play a fucking sick Professor Oak. Yuna, count it down. Three, two, one. Go. Good job. Good job, Yuna. You did it. The world is inhabited by- Oh, fuck! Look at all these bitches! Oh my god, they're everywhere! Fuck! What's up, Mr. Kando? I can't just, my content, comment is confusing as so fuck. It, it's alright. I mean, I feel like this. Again, I'll, I'll, I'll get it pretty quick. So, how do I know whether or not the DVs are good? Because honestly, like, that's kind of like what I'm... If it's a lower number... But, right, but like, I need to know, like, the range, right? I get. I guess when it's, when it's like... When I'm looking at the level and I see, like, so for level 3 Nidoran, it's either an 8 or a 9 attack. I'm hoping it's a 9. If it's a level 3. I guess I'm more just like... Try, like, cause like, if I have like a 14 attack at some point, oh fuck, um, I, I wanna be like, oh, is that lo low or high? Compared to like what it could be. Make me Squirtle. Ooh. I guess I'll take this one. The reason there are Pokemon on the side to track kills and shit is because of how EVs work by killing Pokemon and leveling up. Putting in the Pokemon killed there to calculate an amount for that. Right, but like, so I guess the thing that I was, I was curious about is like, the Pokemon that I kill happens like, oh wait, no, no, that's I guess I never end up killing anything. You know what I mean? I guess if I do? About wild po- Yeah, I never end up killing a wild Pokemon with Nidoran. 
I don't know if I'm supposed to do that. Is there a website? It's a it's an app. It's like a JavaScript thing. Trainers doesn't give EVs. I don't know what you mean. Oh, like like uh, if you if you beat trainers and stuff. I think I think it, it automatically assumes because we fight the same trainers every time. Based on run variation, that runs may kill certain Pokemon when they see them specifically in order to make up for possible stat deficiencies. Okay, that makes sense. Gotcha. Pidgey. You know, would you kill a Pidgey? Or would you be friends with it? I think you'd be friends with it. Uh, they're Pokemons? No, I mean like, what if you shoot the trainer in the face? Do you get DVs from that? What if you're just like, oh, cute Pokemon. Too bad I'm here to fucking end your life. I still can't believe they just fucking pixelated a pigeon. And we're like, yeah, that's a Pidgey. <laughs> yeah, humans have hit points, attack, defense, speed. Definitely special. You know would get carried off by Pidgey? Not wrong. I feel like at this level of speedrunning, it's it's gonna be really easy to get lost in the sauce as far as the DVs and stuff. So I, I part of me doesn't want to worry too much about it, but another part of me is like still curious. Son Sonic's definitely a murderer. All right, one. I'm going to encounter Spiro on Route 3 and decide to kill it in order to buff your Nidoran's attack stat. You would need to track that or else you would track higher DVs than what you actually... Right. I'm just like, damn. Nidoran fucking sucks. I never even considered that because I just figured it would fuck everything up. Especially for like, um... You know, keeping everything on track. Accidentally kill them while learning, right? Or like, or accidentally kill them when you're trying to catch them, or something, maybe. Because I guess that makes sense. Because Route Three, like, if it's a Jigglypuff, you would just fucking run. There's no, there's no point in killing a Jigglypuff. They're just vibing. Oh fuck, that was not, not optimal. Neither was that. Pidgey. Excellent change change in EV. Yeah. That makes sense. Thank you for the help, by the way. Appreciate you guys. It's nice when people who actually know what they're talking about help me. Yes, this is Yuna in my lap. Can't really see it. Yes. She's sleepy. She eepy. Little baby. Uh, I play enough competitive to understand mechanics like that. That makes sense. Yeah, if you tier th if you tier three sub, I'll, I'll move the camera down so that you can see Yuna better. Fuck you. Uh, 
All right. Did you grow up? Did you grow up in that time? Yes, you did. <laughs> okay. 30 seconds run. We can work with that for sure. Don't get poisoned. Okay. Bam, bam, down, down. fucking knit a ran tattoo ca uh, like a uh, calculator tattooed on me that way I can just plug it in to my I don't know I don't know how that would work Maybe it could be like a fucking abacus or whatever and like I just have to have like a pen and I'm just over here doing fucking calculus over here Yeah, maybe maybe I'll get like an abacus piercing. That'd be that'd be kind of sick. You know how people have the like um they have like the the nipple connectors. Like, what if you got like multiple ones and then they're just, it's just like a big abacus. <laughs> My mid rank out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the, the the circle of fists uh, tattoo. Uh, yeah, I did. You got. I'm I'm definitely trying to go for uh, what do you call it? Practical tattoos. So I do have the circle of fists now tattooed on my left my left uh, forearm. fire over here. That's fine. <laughs> abacus implant augmentation. First, I'd probably want to figure out how to use an abacus, because I have no idea how the fuck that shit works. What the fuck? Kill it! Come on, Squirtle. What the fuck you doing? God damn. Abacus earrings? But then you can't see it. Unless you can feel it. I don't want a slide rule. Yeah, slide rule, yeah. Honestly, like, I've seen people get, like, tattoos of just, like, um... Like, on their finger of, like, an actual, like... Like a ruler, you know? So that they can... Oh, fuck. So that they can, like, measure stuff always. They don't need, like, a... Like a what do you call it? You could probably get, like... Just, just simple points on your arm, you know, so that you could like. It's a genius tattoo. Yeah, yeah, it's it's cool. Like I, I really love the idea of like practical tattoos. Ruler tattooed on my dick. Yeah. Starting from the end. <laughs> yeah, it starts at twelve. <laughs> like right at the base of the dick it starts 12 and goes 13, 14, 15, 16 <laughs> but like if you're not a if you're not a fucking shower then you're just gonna fucking when it's soft it's just gonna be like really tiny units
fuck something up. I think I can finish him. Ooh, uh, actually, let's do two Telos. Save. <sighs> I was tail whipping! It's, it is really hard to, like, pay attention to both things here. But. I guess it would help if, um, let me see, level 3, if I just set it at level 10, I guess? Who's horny for muck? Everyone's horny for muck. I think we're... No, we're level 8 coming out of, um... Out of, uh, Brock. Muck definitely has some crazy important categories, for sure. Even though you can... Yeah, at level 8, you finish the fight and just smash the text. Okay, cool. Yeah, I think that's, that's when I'll do it. Like, while I'm mashing text, I can pop it in, because, yeah, there's a lot of text there. Okay. How about nine tails? I want all nine tails in my asshole. One, two, three, go! The world record run starts with I want all nine tails in my asshole. I still haven't seen Naruto. There's so many. There's so much fucking classic anime that I just have to sit down and fucking force myself to watch. Naruto. Uh, Kanto or Alolan? Alolan. Yeah, Alolan one's the fucking best. Let's skip some of the filler. I, everyone says that about every anime, and I'm just not gonna... Like, I would rather just sit there and watch the filler episodes than be, like, sitting there going back and forth between a fucking list of episodes that I'm supposed to watch and not supposed to watch. And then there'll be, like, references to filler episodes, I'm sure. Yeah. That's why you read. You, you, you read manga. I have a bunch of the One Piece ma mangas, but I still haven't gotten around to actually reading it. <laughs> Let's talk about Pokemon porn. Pokemon porn is is it's a cultural phenomenon. Of course, we're going to talk about it. Unless there isn't a manga, I'm reading the manga. Yeah, that's fair. Sonya from Is that a sword and shield? Yeah. Sonya's okay. Not really my vibe. It seemed like very, very like laser uh, laser targeted vibe check for a lot of fucking Pokemon fans. What? Unbelievable. I fucked the wrong mom. I tried to fuck your mom, but I guess I just fucked some other- I'm just gonna run over fucking- Opinions on all three of the big three. What are the- what are the big three? It's Naruto... Dragon Ball Z? Death, Death Note, Bleach, Ble okay, Naruto, Bleach, One Piece, okay. I've heard, I've heard a lot of people are like Bleach is like not. 
I love Death Note. Yeah, Death Note's cool. You love Bleach? Yeah. I know a lot of people who, like, either love Bleach or said it was just boring. Dragon Ball Z is older and done by the time... Done by the time the big three started. Bleach is only bad because it is 60% filler. Everyone's always talking about anime filler. Why won't they anime fill me? Started reading Bleach, you like it yet? Let's see. Plot cells are really good, man. Yeah, it's a pain to wait for English. I guess I'm just like not on the fucking cutting edge of anime, you know? Like I'm not I'm not sitting there just like, ooh, like, you know, frothing at the cock for fucking a new anime series or whatever. Like I, if I want to watch anime, I have so many I have to catch up on. froth at the cock every week for one piece. Yeah, a lot of people froth at the cock for one piece. <laughs> Seems good. I'm just like I, I think I've seen like twenty episodes or something. Maybe less. Turn filler in the seasons was really bad. It is it is funny to me how how much I'm, I'm just kind of basic. I read watch a bunch of popular shonens. I I I have a really hard time being patient enough for a shonen. Anime animation battle stuff doesn't usually like uh, hold my attention for whatever reason. Mob Psycho. Yeah, I know a lot of people who really love Mob Psycho. That's the same studio from um, uh, One Punch Man. It's like more serious though, right? Same author? Oh, gotcha. It's just funny to me how like so much of my like I don't know, the people who, like, watch video game metal guitar covers also like anime, but I guess it makes sense. But, like, I'm not really a huge anime fan. Like, I like it. Um, I just, I have, uh, I don't really have, like, a huge attachment to it. What do we got? We got rats. Ooh. Nice. Very good. We got le original level three. Whatever, like, game music covers. Yeah, true. Especially making them. Are, but I, I feel like it's so like it's so iconic though I still right <laughs> this this d-pad on this controller is not very good I'm, I'm pretty convinced that I might do better with something else I'll need to like look up good d-pad controllers Especially for this game, since so much of it is, like, catching the frame perfects and stuff is, like, movement-based. Because, like, I think you have, like, what, like, eight frames every time you move? So as long as you get your move within those eight frames, it's considered frame-perfect. I did just get the controller, and I've been, I've been using it. Um... It's not really like, I'm not saying that it, it's like going bad. I mean, the design of the D-pad is not what I'm looking for right now. Like it's very easy to roll uh, to different um, controls, but I feel like 
That's not what I want. I want, like, way more precision on the D-pad. There's a lot of gatekeepers, but that's everything. I mean, people always say, like, oh, this fan base sucks, this fan base sucks, and it's it's usually, like, only the... F only the things that are really good will ever get a fan base like that. And people get people get so emotional about things that they get so attached to. Yeah, the Ape do, do one. Like the Pro Controller? Yeah. Maybe I should just go Pro Controller. Mmm... I don't think the D-pad would be bad on those. On the on the one I have. That's gonna kill me. Fucking idiot. I I figure it's it's like what? Like three damage from a poison sting. That's all he ever does to me. And then one point for, for poison. Yeah. I I threw that run away. That was a really, really good run. I just decided to try to be risky with it. That was a throw. All right, now for real. The real run. The real one. The real run. The real first run of the day. Everything else was just warm ups, and now we are gonna do it. Here we go, three, two, one. Keyboard would be fine for this run, I guess. I guess, I just. I never fucking I've never speed ran a game with a keyboard. It seems so weird to me. It's true that that run did get better once World died, but fortunately we need him to live for a little bit longer, and then we can fucking murder him. Thank you, K six. Son, that's what Oka's coming up to me asking, saying, "Are you winning, son? I call you son because I just fucked your mom." What minups you're willing to do? Yeah. Varsity jacket. Also, why is he in varsity? He's supposed to be fucking 10 years old. I'm telling you, man, if that was just like made like a minor key version of that, it'd be so much better. Red does it what he wants. Yeah, like he's wearing a varsity jacket, but he probably bought it from a fucking thrift store, you know? Varsity for, like, a team he doesn't even know. Baby. Just nuzzling my dog. Don't worry, I'm not trying to eat my own ass or anything. Could be his dad's. Who? <laughs> Who is his dad? It's either Professor Oak, some guy who left to get the milk and never came back, or it's Mr. Fucking Mime. And what the fuck team is Mr. Mime on that he can be varsity? Riddle me this, Batman. You would think that they would, like, uncover some kind of plot thing in the anime of, like, Ash's dad coming back to be like, Oh, I heard you're now a great Pokemon trainer, so I decided to reinsert myself back into your life. Can I have money? <laughs> You'd be the stepdad? Yeah. Stepdaddy.
They tease his dad but never committed? Really? Shout out to Gen 3 for having a dad, yeah. It was just as equally not there for his family. I think it's just part of a dad's job, you know? His duty, his responsibility to be irresponsible and have no duty and leave. <laughs> it's just, it's just, it's what they do. He does exist canonically, right? Well, but Ash's dad exists too, you know, just theoretically. What if Red's dad is Giovanni? Then Red's gonna fucking go bald. Maybe he'll go bald at 11. Silver's dad is Geo? No fucking way. In my favorite fucking Pokemon, I was once a fucking thought sperm in the ball sack of Geo fucking Bonnie. It sucks. He has a good reason to hate Team Rocket. <laughs> Why? Because his dad is in it, and he fucking left. Yeah, that was the first run of the day. Tried to add trans characters and got into trouble. Yeah, well, I mean, in Japan, I understand that. Because they are so fucking fucked up about that shit. Why, yeah, why wouldn't he just join Team Rocket? Well, I guess maybe it's just... Like, what if he wants to connect with his dad? Does Team Rocket have, like, fucking bring your son to work day or something? James did have boobs once, that is true. Well, just farther ahead, what do you mean? Oh, America with trans rights and stuff? Yeah, that's true. But Japan is a lot more like, I feel like, stoically uh, adamant. America's just violent and bigoted and stupid, like, individually, but, like, the actual culture of Japan seems like it's very, very rooted in uh, being against that. That little bitch. Not the one I'm looking for. Kind of reminds me of Yuna a little bit. You round. She round. Level four. I'll check the gender sensuality when nothing makers just dumb about it, yeah. Yeah, I think I think definitely when when comparing Japan and America, there's definitely like 
America's ignorance and, and Japan's, like, strictness. For sure. Also allows for cocks and tits to be in media far more than America. What do you mean? Everything's fucking censored over there. Haven't you ever seen a hentai? I'm sorry, haven't you ever seen art? <laughs> what is hentai? I am 10. Well, let me tell ya. It's a female chicken wearing a tie. Going to work. see vagina bones in video games. dumb about this one. It'll be safe. Do you prefer vagina bone in or boneless? I think both have their merits. I think they're both uh, pretty tasty. Pretty delicious. Don't miss that. Don't poison sting me again. I'm already po I'm already poisoned. He's already poisoned. We can't poison him any farther. actually get some more. I mean, this is the first room of the day. Shit attack. You yawning? Doing a big yawn? It's very cute of you. If it's any percentage importing a full level. <laughs> yeah, something about me tell something about that tells me the community will would not not allow that. Fuck! 
I was honestly just like, fuck it. We we did all tail whips and we still got hit with the with the uh, with bide on the last run. I'll just see if I can just finish them off as fast as possible. But yeah, we lost two runs to that Onyx today. Brock's fucking Onyx. I don't know. Yeah, the squirrels have not been hitting very hard today, but yeah. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's just not the day. I'll uh, probably fucking call it here. Yeah, the squirrels have been kind of shit. Let's, uh, yeah. Let's hang out. Let's fucking hang out. All right, get some fucking music going. Yeah, dude, money theme. We don't need a Squirtle DV calculator because, like, we only have Squirtle for, like, only a little while. Reddit time. We're just going to look at Reddit together. There was something... Um, there was a... I had this one idea, and I don't know, like... It's tough because it's kind of like a music stream related thing. But the idea was chat, you guys tell me a song that I've never heard of, right? Like, or like I haven't heard the song. But it's like a really, really like popular song that I just don't know. And so we just like go through songs and just be like, okay, do you know this song? And like look for the one that like all of chat's like, what? You haven't fucking heard that song? And then what I would do is I would try to find a vocal only version of that song. And I would pop it in a Cubase and I would arrange the backing track to what I think it is based on the vocals. So it would be almost like an accidental remix would be the idea. Like acapella, kinda, but it, the other voices wouldn't be like it's just the vocal stem. I think it would be fun. It would be it would be hard and take a lot of effort though. That's the only thing. Um, so there's that. I have been also wanting to do the uh, the chat writes the song thing. Look how Jack kind of does when he plays along with the first listen. Yeah, but I would never actually get a first listen. I would only get the vocals. Or like if it's a mel if, if it's like a an instrumental song, um, I'd only get the melody, and I would have to get like so. Then I would I would kind of put together what I think the song sounds like just based off the vocals, and then we would listen to I've, I've heard Rushy. There's like so many of these that I will I will know, you know. But like I want it to literally be a song I've never heard of, and like stuff like um, I don't know. Uh, Doja Cat, um, Katy Perry, I haven't heard a lot of. I, I, I've heard a lot of old Doja Cat. So if we were to do Buckethead by uh, Colonel Claypool's Bucket of... What? I actually seen the drummer in Mega Death do something similar to this. He only got the singing and made the drums. Yeah, I, I saw... So I've seen, this, I've seen this done with drums before, but not with uh, guitar. And it would obviously be a little bit harder and it'd take a little bit more work than just like kind of like hearing a song and then just immediately like playing the drums on it. Um, Cause luckily drums don't typically have keys. I mean they do, but not the same, but not the keys I'm talking about. There are drum keys, but you know what I mean? It's a little bit harder to kind of just be like, to, to just bust out something on the go. Bandless clay pool, pool briefly formed with Buckethead on guitar. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, like California Girls. Um, yeah, something that's just like, like going through songs that like are, you know, and we could even do like, look at the uh, the top songs l like of today, you know, like Billboard Top 100 and like what's the top song and then see if I can find just a vocal only version. 
What if you just get some indie punk that were smaller to make sure you've never heard of it? Yeah, you could do that too. But I feel like it'd be more fun for a lot more people if they know the song and I don't. You know? About anime songs? Yeah, sure. Actually, I think has Nick Nocturnal done this? Fuck. Nick's always, Nick's always on the fucking cutting edge of that shit, man. I'm trying to do something original for once. <laughs> it does sound like like something Nick Nocturnal would do. Nothing I would be known as. Yeah. I, I love Ska. Ska is like one of my favorite genres of all time. I actually like... When I had the choice as a kid to go, go either the route of metal or Ska, punk, whatever, I actually went ska like i was listening to a lot of um you know voodoo glow skulls uh mill and colin eventually uh streetlight manifesto but catch 22 and stuff like that big uh big big influence to me um but yeah it's an idea i had uh just trying to figure out like new ways to like kind of make streaming different and fun especially like i feel like pokemon is kind of a hard one for a lot of people to kind of uh to kind of be hype about because it's a very very like low energy speed run um at least to to a viewer i feel like so i think it'd be cool to kind of add add something to the streams but um yeah today i've just been exhausted i don't know what the fuck is going on um but i think i, I think i figured like i'd probably just get a few hopefully get one run in and then call it but yeah pokemon's something everyone knows that's for sure whose butt is your arm resting on the new mouse pad it's actually boobs it's a2 from near automata yuna loves a2 yuna likes booba she does like booba it's soft. Cheating on B2, you mean 2B? Should have been butt. Yeah. I've had a few butts. I think I had Pepe butt for a while. All right. Well, I think that'll probably that'll probably do it for me for today. But uh you you don't know that you don't know Pepe? The Pepe ass one is good. Yeah, I like I, I like the Pepe ass. You probably know Pepe. You just don't know that its name is Pepe. All right. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. We're trying to get good at getting these DVs down so we can figure out if our Pokemon is actually good or not. Yeah, too much cum, too much muck. Yuna, say goodbye. Okay, bye.